Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For those of you that are new here, my name is Danielle. I am actually 39 weeks pregnant and I may or may not be in labor or like pre-labor. Um, this may be TMI, especially if you came here for the baby haul, but actually I won't throw the details in, but just I've been having contractions every like seven to nine minutes. Doctor said not to go to the hospital until they're every five minutes. They went away for a long time, but now they're back. Um, so I wanted to do this quick little, I don't know what this would be. I basically pre-ordered two items, um, which is the baby's diaper bag and the packing cubes from Sensible, oh, the Sensible Mama. So I actually watched a review on this bag and then I ended up pre-ordering it. Um, and yeah, so let me show you what I got. So today in the mail, excuse the mess, I have baby stuff here and packages here that I need to open. Um, so I did order the packing cubes and uh, both items are from Itsy Ritzy. And again, I ordered them through the Sensible Mama and there was a coupon code online. So I did save some money from the actual retail price. So I will include the prices on the screen of what they retail for and how much I actually paid. Um, I believe the backpack itself or the diaper bag itself retails for 160 and I paid 160 total for both these items. So I got these really cute um, packing cubes that just released. Um, I'm gonna tell you my first impressions upon opening them right now this is literally me just opening it for the first time. I think that the dimensions were listed online but for some reason I was expecting something bigger as and the material kind of feels a little bit cheap so I'm glad that there was a discount code because it's like as if I got these for free with that discount code because honestly these feel like the print is really pretty, okay. The hardware is really cute. It's rose gold. It comes with three packing cubes. They just go one inside the other. But the material, honestly, like if I was paying full retail, it feels a little bit cheap to me. I mean, I don't, I haven't packed them. This is me unboxing them, so I don't know how they're gonna hold up. This little handle on the side feels cheap. It honestly feels like, like a cheap pencil bag that you can get like at the Dollar Tree or something. Like I'm not impressed by the material at all, but the design is super cute. I feel like I probably could have got something cuter at Ross, like in the makeup bag section to use as packing cubes. So like I said, there are three sizes that come in here. So this one is like the size of the palm of my hand. So it's the smallest bag. And then um, the smallest bag has the little handle thing right here. And then again, it's rose gold, the flower. Um, the medium bag, I don't know what I can compare it to. Here's the big one. I don't know, maybe the medium's the size of my head? I don't know. I just feel like the quality feels a little bit cheap if I'm being completely honest. I'm not impressed. Print's cute. I'm not returning them. I waited a long time to get them because again, I did a pre-order, um, but the quality feels a little bit cheap. The next thing that I got is the Boss diaper bag. I kind of have stuff in it already, but that's just because I was planning to use it as my hospital bag. So I kind of threw some stuff in here, but let me show, let me take out what I have in here and then I'll show you what I'm working with. I literally stuffed it with like the things that are going in my hospital bag because I didn't know if I was going to take one of those carry-on suitcases or what, but I kind of got overwhelmed. I'm like overwhelmed in general 
with like the whole giving birth thing. And even though I've been watching so many YouTube videos of what to pack, I still feel lost as to what to pack. Oh, there's still stuffing paper. Okay, so this backpack on the other hand, this is the new Merlot color that just released. And um, it's like a pretty like wine color. This part here is like a darker, darker Merlot. The inside is like a champagne color with polka dots. Um, I think I'm having a contraction. <laughs> and it comes with this cute little tassel. It's very like heavy. Um, the bottom has the rubber, so there's a lot of pockets and a lot of storage on this thing. So there's a pocket here, a pocket here. There's on the side a bottle insulated pocket. On this side there's a snack pocket that's insulated. And then the inside has so much. I maybe should back you guys up so I can actually show you. Okay. So let me unzip this. So the inside you can see there's plenty of space. It does come all the way down, but there's I forget what they call this. So all your stuff doesn't come flying out. There's pocket 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 there's like two smaller pockets like halfway up there's a key ring and then even the side that flips down there's storage components there there is also a zip pocket in here it goes like down like halfway so there's just a lot of a lot of storage in this bag this front pocket is I'm all like awkward um, the front pocket goes all the way down as well and then in the back it does come with the changing pad and then there's also a pocket up here I think like for sunglasses or for like something techy it's kind of small Sorry, it's not like the best angle. So as far as quality from this backpack, it does feel super nice. Does it feel $160 retail nice? I don't know. The only thing I'm not impressed with on this backpack is the bottom part of these straps. Like this top part feels good, but this bottom part, they feel cheap. Like. The material kind of feels thin. I don't know. I don't know if that's gonna be a problem. Like, I don't know if it's gonna tear soon. Um, I just feel like this little piece itself feels very cheap. The bag itself kind of feels a little bit heavy. Like, I don't, if I were to carry this, like, I would just be getting in and out of the car. Like, this is not a backpack I'm going to pack up at Disneyland and wear on my back all day. Like, it will go at the bottom of the stroller because it feels very, um, sturdy, <laughs> to say the least. But am I going to send it back or anything like that? No, I'm definitely, I'm not unimpressed with it. I think it's a really cute bag, but... I don't know like I don't know why diaper bags are so freaking expensive to be completely honest I like the color I felt like it was very fall and baby girl's gonna be here and it's the fall sorry I'm putting some of my stuff back in so I don't know I thought it would go cute together like this this little pattern with like the Merlot color even though this is gold hardware and this is rose gold I just thought the flower pattern still matched as far as packing cubes for the inside. I honestly don't even know what I'm gonna be putting in the diaper bag. Oh, another thing that it comes with is the um, stroller straps here. I forgot to mention that. So, that's pretty cool. So, I just wanted to show you guys a quick little what diaper bag I ended up going with and if I recommend it or not. I mean, just from off of my first impression. I guess not if I recommend it, just my first impressions of the bag.
so the boss diaper bag I mean it definitely has a lot of space I watched so many reviews with so many diaper bags before choosing this specific one and this one I just felt like it had like a lot to offer um, it only has the one bottle space some of them have two bottle spaces which is good but there's so much inside storage where you can stick your bottles in the inside of the bag I like the outside pockets like to, if you're gonna use it as a mom pocket or whatever to keep your little you know like with me I just carry my wallet and my cell phone I don't need anything else for my purse like I can just stick it on the outside like in one of these little pockets and then just like I already put this folder here I like that too so if there's any important paperwork or whatever say I'm at the doctor's office and they give me something and I have this bag with me I can just slide it in there um, I got this folder for the hospital so whatever they give me I can just put it in there for the baby but yeah I think it's good quality like I said the only thing I'm not impressed with is the quality or like the material of this specific part I wouldn't say that would deter me from buying it I don't know I'm just saying for the price it better last <laughs> so yeah that is my little first impression of the diaper bag and the packing cube sorry if this video was all over the place like I said I'm 39 weeks pregnant I may or may not be in labor I've been having contractions and yeah. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye.